Majority of our society enjoys consuming meat on the daily. Why wouldn't they? It has high protein, it's a good source of iron, and overall has great flavor. But the concept of meat isn't as perfect as you would like to think. Though it has its benefits for your body and taste buds, it unfortunately has its cons as well. Meat requires a lot of water to be produced. From raising the animals to cooking the meat itself, approximately 9,085 liters of water is needed just to make one pound. That is a lot of water. If this keeps up, imagine how much water would be used and wasted. or Meat No More is a movement that encourages kids to eat less meat. Meat uses a lot of water to produce, not only to make the meat, but to raise the animals as well. m and wants to encourage kids to eat less meat. Just imagine how much water you can save by not eating meat for only one day of the week. That's why we would like to encourage kids to start Meatless Monday. We wanted to see how much meat students in our school community consume, so we made an online survey asking questions about their meat consumption. The results showed that the majority of 8th graders in our school consume chicken and beef and they eat meat about three to four days a week. To make one kilogram of beef, 15,400 liters of water is needed, and for chicken, 4,300 liters of water is required. We can definitely reduce the amount of meat we consume and the amount of water wasted, and M&M wants to make that change. No, I don't want no rest Echoing around these walls Fighting to create a song Maybe a few days, I don't know, probably not. I don't think I could go a day. Definitely not. I need my beef, I need my chicken. No, of course not. When getting negative responses, we wanted to prove to them that not eating meat is not as difficult as it seems. M&M finally decided to do a meat-free week. While we did not eat meat, we promoted the message of reducing the amount of meat consumed. We made posters and put it around our school. We also made an Instagram account posting messages to reduce the meat you eat. In total, we managed to save 1,190.32 liters of water by not eating meat for one week. If you think you can't go meat-free for a whole week, then why not try a meatless Monday? No meat for only one day of a week. It would in fact save a lot more water than you think. Just imagine how much water we can save by not eating meat for one day of the week. And continue this for years to come. Recently, Canada's Food Guide updated the meat servings that they recommended for us to eat. Their motive is for us to consume more vegetables than meat and dairy products. Although the changes were not focused upon the water uptake, it benefits to help us solve that issue. Water is essential for us to live as it has many benefits for all living things. As humans, it's our job to make sure we use a limited amount of water and to save it to the best of our ability. Next time you choose what to eat, keep in mind the massive amount of water that went into making the meal. Thank, Thank you for watching!